average about a third of an inch of snow here in Milwaukee for the month of October, and the average first trace of snow is coming up this coming Monday, so we're kind of on track. Yesterday, Chicago saw a little bit of snow. There were flurries around here today. Uh, no accumulation, though. That is the good news, and still might be even seeing a few flurries off to the west of us and down to the south as we speak. To the graphics we go. It was 44 today, and you're saying, how was it snowing when it was 44 degrees? That's right at the surface level. You go just a few feet up, it's below the freezing level and or the freezing mark, so it doesn't have time to thaw out. So you're seeing those wet snowflakes falling, and it could happen once again tomorrow. Well below the normal of 57, the record was 84. This morning we were 31. First flurries of the season. A year ago we were normal at 58 degrees. What a tale of two. Uh, months almost. I mean, this is just crazy. The first two weeks of this month, we are an average high of almost 70 degrees. So far, the second half has been 51. This week, we have had trouble getting out of the 40s, and that is typical for November, mid to late November. Temperatures now right back down into the 30s, 38 in Milwaukee, 34 in Burlington and Waukesha. We drop back down into the 20s for most of the area. Wind chills close to 20 by morning. We'll be close to 30 by the lakefront tomorrow. Sunshine early, a few clouds in the afternoon, could see a few sprinkles and flurries like today, and highs once again in the lower 40s. Otherwise, we stay quiet as this high pressure system moves in. We don't see our next chance of rain until Monday night of next week. Low tonight, near 30 degrees, colder inland, wind chills near 20. Tomorrow starts off sunny, then becoming partly cloudy, and a high of 43. The 10 day outlook showing you a gradual warming trend. Good news for trick or treaters this weekend. It's going to be dry and near 50 degrees. And the next week, getting back to normal into the mid 50s, but rain likely Monday through Wednesday. 